be showing you an unboxing video of some Stanley Jigs. Here's my box right here. I don't know. This is my fishing knife. Oh, looks like we already got some good stuff. We got some ribbit, garlic scented, so that must should be really good. If I'm able to like find a pond, I'll definitely use these. Oh, and look, we got some swim max. These should be able to help for the frogs that I just showed you. It's more swim max, but this time these don't have weights on them. If you can see them. Oh, I got two of their famous jigs. There we go, both black and green. Ooh, some more rivet garlic scented. These frogs should work really good if I can find a good bass pot. Those ones are floating. Here we have a uh, fiber chef spinner bait. This should work really good in the springtime. Another one, except this one is more of a green and white chartreuse color. Two more of the same kind. Oh, and yet some more jigs. This should be good. We have. Let's see what this is. It's a rattling series flipping jig. 3 8 sounds. Another one of those. And then this one looks more of like a rattling crawfish color. These should work really good. Now we've got some sidetrack shad. Four and a half inches. These would work good on these hooks we got earlier. And then now, let's see what these are. Ooh, a mud puppy. These look pretty long. But they seem like they should have a lot of action on them. Some more sidetrack shad, so I can just get some more bass. And then some more of the sidetrack mud puppy. I'm going to get a closer look at these guys. That movie feels a little bit slimy. Uh, the sparkles, if you can see it all there, those should really attract the fish. So it looks like these two little knobs should give them lots of action. Thanks for watching, and make sure to like, subscribe, and comment. Make sure to comment uh, which bait you would like me to show you how to use, and I might get some video of me catching fish with that exact bait that you told me to use. Thanks.